My name is Brooke McCowan. I'm the research and development manager here at Jayberry Nursery, and this is my house that I have a lot of fun in at work. Um, today, I'm going to show you how we pollinate our Hollywood hibiscus here in the nursery. Um, so basically, take a look at our mother plants that we're going to be pollinating today. Uh, we see that this plant is a whole lot shorter than the sister here to it. It has a lot of bud counts on the plant. This one has a little bit less bud counts and it's a lot taller in stature. So what I want to do is I want to incorporate the short plant habit and the well branching traits of this plant and incorporate it to this plant with dark stems and a beautiful flower. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to select an open flower here. I'm going to remove the pistil like so. And I'm going to transfer the pollen over to this other plant gently. Just gently dab the pollen on that plant. So now in order to know that this plant was pollinated, after a couple of days this flower is going to fall off. And we're not going to be able to tell which flower we pollinated unless we put a tag on it. So you'll see on other plants we have tags located on here to take note of the parentage of which mother plant and which father plant we pollinated here. So I'm going to do that here in just a few minutes and indicate which one we pollinated. Over the course of the next few months, we're going to continue to watch this plant. And as we see this plant set seed, we're going to come back over here and I'll show you an example. If it sets seed, this is going to close up just like this. We're going to continue to let it mature, and then once it's mature, we're going to break that off and collect the seed. As the seed matures, the, the green is going to transition into this yellow color, letting you know that it is mature and ready to harvest. Once we collect our seeds, I will save them until next spring, early in January. I'll plant them into some of our 50 count cells and propagation soil mix, hand plant them one by one. And this is where our next generations of Hollywood hibiscus are going to come from.